Buoyancy is also misunderstood by flat earthers. They actually have this exactly backwards. Buoyancy is a direct result of gravity, not a defiance of gravity. A helium balloon goes up because helium is a very light gas. It has less density than the air around it. So gravity pulls down on the air a little stronger than it does on the helium balloon, and this forces the balloon up. The same goes for a cork in water. The water is more dense, so it is pulled down around the cork, which forces the cork up. And again, the direction of the buoyant action is always up and down, never sideways or any other direction. Gravity deniers have no explanation for the consistent direction. Here is a very simple experiment. Put a ball and a cork in a filled water bottle. The ball drops to the bottom and the cork floats to the top. Now, turn the bottle over and they will switch positions. No matter how you turn the bottle, the cork will seek the highest point and the ball the lowest point. Everything in the bottle is being pulled down by the external force of gravity. The ball is the most dense, so it has no problem pushing the water out of the way. The cork is the least dense, so it cannot push the water out of the way. The weight of the water being pulled down by gravity forces the lighter cork up. Density and buoyancy alone do not explain these effects, as flat earthers try to claim. Only the consistent downward force of gravity can explain this.